Dodge is setting up the stage for a big reveal. A new pickup's in the works. We've got the lowdown from spy shots, giving us a sneak peek at its design. And while fans are busy speculating about its specs, the real fuel for debate is the name. The company is bringing back 2025 Dodge Dakota. Well, there are a few hooks. The upcoming 2025 Dakota won't just be a blast from the past. This ain't your grandpa's mid-sized truck. Initially, we were eyeing it as a Jeep Gladiator substitute, but that will be the Ram Rampage. Who knew a few years back that compact pickups would be the hot ticket? Ford's already blazing trails with the Maverick, and you can bet other automakers are gunning for their piece of the action. Toyota's got their stout in the works, and Stellantis Group is jumping into the ring too with one of the iconic truck brands. There's the kicker, the truck maker is feeling the heat. They gotta put the pedal to the metal. And hey, don't be surprised if you see the Dakota taking the Ram badge eventually, unlocking a whole new world of possibilities. The spy shots have hit the scene, confirming that trucks well into the final stages of development, it's even hitting the streets for testing. From what we've seen, it's got that unmistakable Ram 1500 vibe, just in a more compact package. With the test mule rolling up the streets, the 2025 Dodge Dakota's debut seems to be very close. While prototypes are shedding some light, the name, drivetrain specs, and interior details remain under wraps. But one thing's for sure, it's gonna be a compact pickup. Inside, don't expect anything radically different than other trucks of this segment's offer. Dodge is sticking to their signature design language, aiming to amp up comfort and safety to the max. The 2025 Dodge Dakota is getting a hybrid configuration that's set to shake up the scene. But don't be surprised if company isn't keeping this setup exclusively for the pickup truck to rival Ford Maverick. However, models of this class are mostly sharing engine choices with compact crossover, the Jeep Cherokee in this case. That means a plug-in hybrid with 240 horsepower and 200 pound-feet of torque, 30 miles of electric range, and impressive gas mileage that will depend on the size of the truck. Still, a naturally aspirated 2.4-liter unit is going to be the base engine. It delivers a solid 180 horses and 170 pound-feet of torque. Paired with a smooth 9-speed gearbox, it's a recipe for some serious performance. Matching the Cherokee's 2,000 pounds of towing capacity is not enough. Dakota's drivers need more. There is a simple solution, the turbocharged option. In this case, truckers can get 270 ponies under the hood and the towing capacity beefed up to 4,000 pounds. In the compact truck world, the mileage might be more appreciated. With a more power comes a higher price tag. Either power plant might get a hybrid boost that will stun the competition. The highly anticipated debut of the all-new Dakota, now flying the Dodge banner, is very close, if those spy photos are anything to go by. But the truck maker keeping their cards close to the chest, holding off on the official release date until the end of the year. Brace yourselves folks, it can become public any day. As for sticker shock, expect the base price to hover around $23,000. A 2.4-liter engine is striking the perfect balance between towing capacity and fuel economy. But if you want that turbocharged kick, be ready to add an extra 3,000 to 5,000 bucks. Hybrid is still a real mystery, since the company is yet to launch the Jeep Compass with this technology in the US.